Good morning everybody, I'm Shmi and welcome to the second episode of A Shmi in Paris. It is early on Saturday, I think, morning here. Uh, yesterday we found that Bugatti Louis Blanc. Obviously that was pretty exciting. But this morning I am out with my good friend in Paris, Mr. Alex Smolik. Hello everyone. You may remember Alex went down with me to Monaco last year, good times, and today we are reuniting for another car related adventure. adventure indeed. We're off to the chateau just on the outskirts of Paris for a supercar event. So let's see where this takes us. Finally got the car out of the garage, which is no easy task. Firstly, Paris garages are very, very narrow, so they really don't make it easy to get the car out. And then you need the passenger to put the ticket in the machine. I am because... a very useful person. <laughs> yeah, indeed, Alex, indeed. <laughs> For a Saturday morning drive, we are in convoy with a noble to the right. and a Bentley, and Keep we're to the going right. through the French countryside. It's quite bright, and I've got a new passenger today, so I'll let him introduce himself. Hello, I'm Sergio Giesbers, and uh, I'm a photographer, and uh, Smith is gonna put a link on my Flickr. Yeah, so I'll put Sega's link to his Flickr stream in the description down below, make sure you check it out. He's a pretty awesome photographer. And uh, on we go with the convoy. Yeah. <laughs> the convoy was a good bit of fun and we made it to Tuari, the chateau where we are now. And this is the event. I think you can see just about behind me. There is somewhere in this crowd an Aventador, and we've got a whole lineup of other cars. There's a 458, and mine, and a few more just going for charity rides around the local area. So that's pretty good fun to show you a couple of clips of the cars driving around here. Already today I have given a good number of rides, it's pretty fun around here in France. And I went out in this KTM Expo and boy was it fast, that was a crazy, crazy experience. Wow, I'm still sort of recovering ages later. Just the feeling of being open, not too many bugs, although I did get one little like stone hit me in the head or something, I don't know. Actually it was probably nothing, just due to the speed it felt quite strong. But uh, some great, great cars. The event store is absolutely nailing it. So, sadly, it seems proceedings are being brought to a bit of a wet halt. As you can see, it is kind of pouring down. Although it's kind of funny because when you get a car like the KTM, they have to put their uh, proper like rain cover on, and everybody literally ran their roofs and the roof started because it's been quite a sunny day so it's a bit a bit strange uh, pretty cool I'm sure wet roads are gonna make some interesting things this afternoon
it has been a pretty fun event, but it is time to head home. The rain is coming down. But we're actually going to go to Paris, where hopefully the weather is better, and see what we can find. driving around Paris can be absolute mayhem, but you then come into a garage and you're greeted with scenes like this. I think I did the right thing in completing the trio and nice colours for these two 458s. Absolutely gorgeous, don't you think? Clearly plenty of cars to spot out here, but now I'm stuck in the middle of the Champs-Élysées. There are about five lanes of traffic on both sides, and it's mayhem. Oh good, I can go. Uh, but off to find some more. Needless to say, it has been a very successful spotting day. But we're packing in earlier this evening because we had a pretty short night last night and tomorrow morning is up early again for Cars and Coffee, a gathering of about 100, excuse me, 150 cars, including some pretty nice stuff. So that's going to be vlog three and I think it should be quite a good one. So stay tuned for that and the journey back home and once again, Thank you for watching. A shmi in Paris. We're off on a little trip. I'm going.